I'm Italian chef Deborah Del Fogo, and today I'm going to teach you to make a delicious spring dish called Asparagi alla Milanese, Milanese style asparagus. I've got a beautiful bunch of asparagus that I brought back from my market, and when you get them home, a little pro tip is to cut about an inch off the bottom, and it's easy because there's usually a rubber band holding them together. And then just put them in a little bit of water, like about an inch of water, and they'll stay fresh on your countertop for a couple days. Milanese style asparagus is a very easy dish to make, and you probably have all the ingredients in your refrigerator. We're using butter, eggs, parmigiano reggiano, a little lemon juice and olive oil to garnish if you like. So let's get started. The way to trim asparagus is to take a stalk, we're gonna separate the tender part, from the tough inedible part, the fibrous part. And we're just gonna bend it. And we're just gonna snap it off like that and it snaps off at the perfect place. You saw how I did that. It's very easy. You just kind of bend it and it snaps off at the perfect natural spot. And then you can line them up on your cutting board and just cut, use, the, use one as a guide and just cut them all the same length. I've got about an inch of water boiling in a nonstick skillet. I'm going to season it with some kosher salt, and then I'm just gonna put my asparagus right in. The asparagus should take about five minutes to cook, depending on the thickness, but we'll test with the point of a knife just to make sure that they're the perfect doneness. So our asparagus are cooked al dente, and I tested them with the point of a knife inserted into the base. Now we're just going to remove them from the water and just shake off the excess water and put them right on our nice warm plate. The one thing I love about this dish is that it only uses one pan. So I'm going to get rid of the water and then we'll cook our egg in the same pan. I've got about a tablespoon of butter melted in my skillet and I already broke my egg into a little bowl so that I could pour it easily. I'm gonna put it right in my pan and I'm gonna season it with a little bit of salt and some freshly ground pepper. White pepper, black pepper, or no pepper, you decide. For Milanese style asparagus, we want the egg to be cooked sunny side up with the white cooked through but the yolk still runny. That's an important part of this dish because we want to be able to dip our asparagus spear into the runny yolk. It's so delicious. So I think our egg is cooked. Oh, it looks beautiful. Now what we're gonna do is just slide it right out onto our asparagus spears and leave the tips of the spears showing, peeking out from the egg and then pour the rest of the butter right on top. Grate a little bit of parmigiano reggiano right over the top. And that's our dish, asparagi alla milanese, milanese-style asparagus. Bon appetito!